Hello everyone, I'm Annette Rockcliffe, Mayor of Devonport. For those of you who are tuning in for the first time, this is my Mayor's message. It's been a busy time for our community services teams at Council who have organised various events this past month, including International Women's Day celebrations and diamonds at Devonport. We also enjoyed two weeks of celebrations for this, this year's Devonport Food and Wine. Council was hoping to celebrate our Carmody Day event this Thursday with Street Eats at Market Square, but unfortunately we've had to cancel due to a lack of registration numbers. This was extremely disappointing for our staff who have been keen to put on another great celebration like 2019. Last year was the first event Council had to cancel as a result of COVID. However, we had to be mindful to ensure that our food vendors were not left out of pocket, so we've cancelled. Let's look to next year's event and make sure we can really get behind this important annual celebration, which is aimed at promoting an, a tolerant and culturally diverse society. Harmony Day will be officially celebrated throughout Australia this Sunday. Despite cancelling our Harmony Day event, the Council will continue with the citizenship ceremony and we look forward to officially welcoming six new citizens to our city. The event will be for new citizens and their family members only. Council was pleased to announce last week that the Provenal Place markets are back from Friday the 9th of April. After the success of the Christmas markets last year, it's exciting to see that the Provenal Place markets restart and we know that people are looking forward to this Friday night option. Council would like to see this monthly market grow and develop further and we're pleased to have Belle Stott coordinating the markets. We know she'll bring fresh and new ideas to this already successful model. Belle is really keen to hear from the eager storeholders wishing to part, be part of this Twilight Market, which will be held on the second Friday of every month from 4 to 8 in Market Square. Please contact Belle at ProvidorPlaceMarket at gmail.com or send a message via the Providor Place Facebook page if you're interested in being part of it. Calling all skateboards, scooter and BMX enthusiasts, head down to the Bluff Skate Park this Saturday, the 20th of March, for the Know Your Odds competition. This series is a partnership between Council, Youth, Family and Community Connections and with support from Anglicare's Gamblers Help Program. This is the eighth year the competition has given young people across the coast a chance to show off their skills in a positive way. Please head down to this free event. Registration is open from 10am and parental consent is required for those under 18. There will be a junior and a senior age division for each of the three sports and helmets are compulsory for all competitors. Devonport Motor Show will, is on this weekend from Friday evening until Sunday afternoon with an expo being held in the Paranormal Convention Centre. The expo will feature 25 vehicles and some of these have never been on public display before. There's also an opportunity for members of the public to test drive an electric vehicle on come along to level one of the multi-level car park of Devonport on Sunday for the electric vehicles part. And you can check out some of the latest electronic cars as part of Denpot's electric car now. For more information on what's happening at Council, please check out our Facebook, Twitter and LinkedIn pages. Until next time, thank you for listening.